Hey everyone, Zane here, and today we are going to compare between Figma versus Framer. And in this video, I will answer the what tool should I pick question for Figma and Framer. First off, these are two very different tools. Figma is a general design tool, while Framer is a no-code web design tool. So let me give you a small example to clarify. If we were in construction, Figma would be for creating the blueprint of a building while Framer would be for creating the full building. In Figma, you can design whatever you can imagine, but if you want to create something like an app or a website, then you still have to hand it off to someone who creates this in some other kind of tool or with code. In Framer, you can design whatever you can imagine on the web and then just hit publish without ever needing help from other people. But three keywords here are on the web. With Framer, you only create and publish things on the websites. So if you are asking yourself, what tool should I pick? You first need to understand what you are trying to do here. If you are just creating websites all day, every day, then Framer is for sure going to be enough as the only design tool in your stack. If you create other things than just websites like graphics, apps, dashboards, you name it, then Figma should probably be a big part of your workflow. And even if you choose to just go with one of the tools for now, although they cover different use cases, their interfaces are still very similar. So if you master one of them, it will be pretty easy to get a hang of the other one. And that is it for today's comparison. If you find this video helpful, please don't forget to support us with like, subscribe, comment, share. Thanks for watching and see you in a new video.